Hello, hello, and welcome to Healthy Life with Kimmy. So today I'm talking about structure. Are you a structured person? Do you like structure? Do you like to know for sure at a certain time, A, B, C, D is gonna happen? Or are you kind of willy-nilly? I tend to be kind of willy-nilly in my life. Not when it comes to my business and going to work and things of that sort. But when it comes to certain things, I just don't like structure. I don't like commitment. I'm afraid of it. It, even with something it's like like this channel that I'm doing and when I first started it I was kind of concerned my husband was also concerned he was like well what if you don't do what you say you're gonna do <laughs> a couple of my friends were worried for me too they was like well, what if you don't lose weight <laughs> well that's why I always say from the very beginning I knew I wouldn't do this thing perfectly right but I'm trying and I want to do it and that's my goal so that didn't frighten me when everybody was saying don't do the channel because of that reason if i don't make it i'll make it i tried that's how i feel but i do want to succeed so i'm gonna have to get structure in my life so what does that structure look like as far as doing weight watchers and living a healthy lifestyle with weight watchers you have to track your points so where i may just wake up and decide willy-nilly i'm just gonna eat whatever i don't have to be accountable my tracking system is my accountability when I look at the number of points that I have per day and I know that I've gone over those points or I'm close to it, that's my accountability. That's my contract with myself saying, hey, that's enough or you can't do this. Sometimes I don't like the word no. So my contract with myself and my commitment to myself is by tracking. So when I track my food, which is the system that Weight Watchers uses um, on my phone, Again, it's my commitment to myself saying, hey, you want to be healthy, this is what you have to do. They've already done the homework for me to let me know what the value system is of each particular thing I want to eat. Even restaurants are included in the plan. So now I have to be committed. I have to have some structure. I have to think about what I'm going to eat for breakfast, what I'm going to eat for dinner. Am I going to drink this? Am I going to eat that? And again, I'm not used to doing that. So thus... I have no structure I do what I want these are the results that I have right now which, which is my health having some difficulties right so you're either gonna have some structure that you create that's me deciding I'm going to track I'm going to be accountable to what I what I put in my mouth or eventually the structure is gonna happen for me anyway what is what do I mean by that I'm gonna be laid up in the hospital. They're gonna be telling me what I have to eat. They're gonna be giving me bland food. They're gonna be putting food through my tubes or whatever, cause I don't get my health together. So either I'm gonna decide the structure that I choose for myself, or it will be chosen. Either way, it's gonna be some structure, right? So I've decided that I am going to track. I am going to have structure. And it's not gonna be perfect, but I am going to try. So I have been tracking my points. I have. Learn, I'm learning how to work the app. There is a couple of trainings that Weight Watchers offers to help you learn how to navigate the application. It goes over how to input your, your meals. It goes over how to pre-choose what you're gonna eat. You can, like in advance, you can create a menu. They have menu options for you already, like for the whole week pre-planned so you don't even have to think about it you might say i'm going to use this plan for this week i'm going to use this plan for next week and you don't even have to think about it go to the grocery store and buy it within the app there's even a little barcode where you can scan like if you're at the grocery store and it has a barcode you can scan and see how many value points that particular food has and it may influence your decision so i'm gonna tell you another story in another video about how the app saved me <laughs> so within the app though um um, it's, it's a lot of very, very cool features. And if you're kind of techie anyway, that might be an excellent way for you to use it and get healthy. It really might be. Because some people, I know even for my husband, he loves playing with the app. And we have a couple of friends, they love the app part. You know, we all like digital. We like stuff in our hands that we can touch. So for myself too, I didn't think I would like that. But I actually have been liking it. So again, as I want to just reiterate you can choose to have some structure for you what you're gonna put in your mouth what you're gonna eat or eventually if you don't make these choices now they will be made for you later how many people do you know that's laid up in the hospital 
where with diabetes running the community, high blood pressure, all these different things that we can make our changes right now on our own, smaller changes, or if we don't make them, again, it's going to be made for us because we're going to be laid up somewhere.